Swimming World TV here with Camille Adams. First swim of the meet complete. How do you feel getting NCAAs picked off? Yeah, I mean, it wasn't quite the race I was expecting, but you could just kind of, at this point, you have to learn to roll with the punches, and um, I'm really, really excited for the 4 and I'm That's I've definitely dropped a lot of time in that this year, so I think that's going to be an awesome swim for me tomorrow, and it could be a blessing in disguise having the night off tonight just to kind of rest and recuperate and regroup um, for tomorrow morning. So to talk about day number one was the 500 freestyle. You just missed on making it back. You were 17th. Does it make it does it make it sting a little bit more because it's 17th? Would you have wanted to swim it again tonight? Um, I mean, I didn't swim it a second time last year either, which is definitely a bummer. Doing the same thing again this year, um, but just kind of like I said, just kind of have to learn from your mistakes and kind of see what I can do better next year. Um, and then, I mean, hopefully it'll be nice getting some rest tonight, and then I think it'll really benefit me for tomorrow morning. This 400 IM you just mentioned, you've dr dropped a lot of time in. Why, what do you attribute that to? Yeah, I mean, I think definitely Steve and I have worked a lot on my backstroke and my breaststroke this year, which from looking at stuff from last year, it definitely needed a lot of work. Um, I've done a lot of like underwater work, and I think that's also helped, and it's also kind of moved over to my fly as well, so it's been good. All right, speaking of fly, that's going to be the big one yeah. this meet. You aren't going to be going head-to-head -head with Hoshu this year. <laughs> you were second to her last year. What is, what is the goal in your 200 fly? Yeah, I mean, my goals are always my best time, so I think going to best time would just be awesome awesome for me right now. Um, I mean, coming off the Olympics, I just learned so much from that experience, and then I think it'll really benefit me going into um, Saturday's race and done a lot of stuff to kind of work on the length of my stroke and make sure I'm catching the same amount of water up front, um, and then my underwaters, like I said previously, so I'm really, really excited for that one as well. So is underwater one of the biggest things you focus on in the two-fly? Um, not so much. More towards the end, whenever people are coming right up, if you can just get a little bit more distance off the wall, it kind of helps out. How does the NCAA platform compared to just coming off of London? Yeah, I mean, it definitely does. This is such an exciting meet, and having SECs um, getting to host it for the first time was just as exciting, and um, I think that did a great job platforming us into coming in, coming into NCAA. so it's awesome to see teammates from the Olympics here, and just um, kind of a little mini reunion, so it's just a fun meet. Is it, how would you compare the pressure? Um, I mean, I don't really get too nervous, I guess, um, so I, I mean, it's kind of, kind of about the same. I've kind of learned, like, when, how to get myself a little bit more nervous and how to kind of control those nerves and great thanks Camille thanks and gig um go